Good morning, and welcome back to Living with a Classic. It's about 5 a.m. here, completely dark outside, and I'm about to head off for the road trip for parts to pick up the uh, gearbox for the S-Type. Uh, I'm about to go get my friend Jacob. Uh, we're going to meet up at the gas station, and he's coming along for the trip, which will be a lot of fun. We're also picking up some parts for his 944 project car, uh, some wheels for it, and some suspension bits. I'm also picking up some wheels for a uh, friend of mine for a XJS. All in all, it will be about 1,200 kilometers, which is about 750 miles today. It will be quite a long day, many hours on the road. I'll be back later to show some updates along the road and see what's going on. All right, so this is eight hours later, 500 kilometers, and we've picked up uh, Jacob's bits. Oh, by the way, this is Jacob. Uh, parts for his um, 85 944. So what you got? We got suspension front and back. Uh, that includes, um, well, first of all, wider wheels on the back, wider wheels in front. Um, and we haggled. We haggled. We got like 500 bucks off. We got basically a uh, two thirds of the price is what I paid. Um, so he's buying me lunch. This okay, is, we're still this discussing is, that. Right. Anyhow, um, we got um, so suspension for the nine four four that included camber plates, shocks, rears, and front. Um, the sway bar, which is homemade adjustable. Yep. We'll show pictures later. There's lots of holes in it. <laughs> As it should be. It's the holy sway bar. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh boy. We got, we got to meet a pretty cool guy too. He had a um, 72, 73, 911 that he's been restoring for 10 years. Mm -hmm. um, I don't see how it took 10 years, but I'm, I'm happy he's done soon. So now it's, uh, it's almost one o'clock here. We're going to try and get some lunch, also to kill a little bit of time. And then we're going to go get my gearbox, which I hope is not as heavy as I think it is. Mm. But we'll see, because I haven't been able to find anywhere online what it weighs and I'm not sure if it's cast iron or aluminum but we'll find mm. out then more updates will come but now lunch lunch all right so now we're driving back from uh, almost Stockholm, we're about 10 kilometers from Stockholm in a place called Huddinge. Uh It's about four or five hours later. We did stop for lunch though, so that took some time, but mm -hmm. it was worth it. Uh, we uh, picked up a, another set of wheels that you can see behind here. They're for my friend Matt, who has an XJS. Um, they are from an, an XKR, yeah. XKR. I think so. It says supercharged on them, but uh, they were heavy. Uh, they're as heavy as your wheels. Right about. Mine are, mine are 17 versus 16. 16, yeah. Yep. Uh, they look small though when we took them out. I thought they were 15s at first. Yeah. That's just because your wheels are massive. Yep. Um, then the gearbox. Thankfully, it was split in half. So the uh, bell housing was already off it. Because it was cast iron. And extremely heavy. Mm -hmm. Also, there was a fitting missing, so it was pouring oil over his driveway. I feel a little bit bad about that. But ATF is a detergent. It does clean. Um, so, yeah, we just filled up with gas, and the car does have quite, quite a gangster lead. Now we have another five and a half hours home, which will hopefully be a good trip. We're past like the south of uh, around Stockholm now where there's a bunch of traffic so I think we've passed most of the traffic and it should just go on but an update will come later
I just dropped off Jacob and the parts for his uh, 944 and I'm driving just the last bit back to my house. It's been a long day, it's 11.30 at night and I've driven exactly 1,210 kilometers which I think is about 750, 755 miles which is quite a bit. We were both a little bit tired there in the last hour, but overall it's gone really well. We got some really, really good parts. I'm definitely really happy about getting a gearbox and starter motor and just being able to continue on the S-Type. Also, it's always fun with a good road trip. Anyways, thank you for watching Living With The Classic. Hope you found this little bit of a different video format fun, just kind of a road trip vlog. If you want to see more content like this on um, my channel, please leave a comment if you like this format. And if you're not already a subscriber, I highly recommend that you subscribe for weekly content. And you can check out some of my other videos down below. Until then, I'm Adam, and this is Living With A Classic. See you soon.